Hey guys, well, we're gonna unlock another fifth weapon, and the next two fifth weapons we're gonna get both have four votes. And the first one I'm gonna unlock is Shaho Yuan's. So, I'm gonna go and play in original mode to get the fifth weapon. We're gonna go to the Battle of Tongue Gate. We're gonna play under South South Forces. And obviously, play as Shaho Yuan. And there we go. Let's do it. Alright, so the level itself, I mean, we actually unlocked Shu Huang's fifth weapon here. And believe it or not, Shu Huang's fifth weapon requirements and Zhao Yuan's fifth weapon requirements are exactly the same thing. I mean, I'll say it here. So all you have to do is make sure Han Sui defects. And in order to do that, you have to do a couple of things. Um, I said it in Shu Huang's fifth weapon. I'll do it here once we start, but uh, this is not my first time going for Zhao Yuan's fifth weapon. Uh, I actually learned a few a possible indicators on, well, it will determine how long Hansu will take for him to actually defect. But I will actually point out those indicators, well, like I said, possible indicators, once we start. But for now, we know the intro, we know the conditions, the equipment, the weapon, here's the fourth weapon, so there we go, the items, well, Musu armor right off the bat, elixir, way of Musu, I am not using a horse because the map is small, well, it's easy to go from place to place due to the fact that the map is small, um, but yeah, uh, defense, and uh, Hat? Uh, you know what? Let's go with the speed squirrel. There we go. Alright, bodyguards. For some reason, I keep on switching. Well, I always switch to them. In the last part, I know I swapped them to attack, but... Even on my failed recording, I forget to set the shield. So, here we go. Alright, let's do it. And hopefully not watch Sal Sal get killed. <laughs> That's a failed recording. I actually saw Sal Sal die. You know, I don't really feel that good about this fight. Must you? Always look for justice in battle. I will do anything, anything to obtain Guan Zhang. Zhu Huan, I need your help for that. Very well. I shall prepare for the journey north. Lord Coco! Food has been prepared! You can't fight on an empty stomach! I think perhaps it is better this way. Huh? Just a mixed unit. They're no match for us. Jiaha One, Kaoren, station yourselves in front of the Tan Gate. Ju Hua, send a detachment to cross to the south. Alright, so as I mentioned, to get Shaho you want fifth weapon, we have to make sure Han Sui defects. And to make sure that cutscene where Sao Sao and Han Sui meet, you have to make sure you defeat Ma Dai and Pang Da. And we're almost done defeating Ma Dai. Goodbye. Alright, that's one down. Now, Pang Da. There we go. Alright, this will take a bit. And this will hurt. Good. We will attack them with the southern unit first. 
33, not bad. Alright, Pung does down. I defeated an officer. And Ma Chao's out. Let's defeat Cheng Yin since he's right here. Might as well, right? Let's go. That was a lucky hit. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Don't get too deep. Wait here for support. All right, enough with the show, Bolton. All right, we need to separate him from the pack because he's obliterating the living shit out of my bodyguard. Well, somebody's desperate to kill me. Well, I lost one bodyguard. Wasn't a surprise. I mean, he obliterated the living shit out of my bodyguard. What is going on? You know what? Now I have to play cheap. Goodbye. Defeated an officer. All right, he's down. I'm sorry. Put away your sword. Cow cow, what are you up to? You and I have been friends for a long time. Come now, don't you think we can just talk this over? Alright, so once that cutscene happens, Hansui's morale would drop. And let's see here. If it's at six, like I'm thinking it is. Okay, you gotta make sure that morale stays at six. If you make it well, if you see his morale at eight, then it's gonna take a long time for Hansui's effect. Well, for what I see anyway. Because every time I had Hansui's morale at 6 when I was going for Shu Huang's 5th weapon, even after, just to see to test it. And, um, yeah, he defects really quickly. But here, that's a different story. He'll still take a while anyway, and I'm hitting the wrong pot. Yeah, I definitely needed that. So, EQ did do two things. One, Go to the top and try to save Shu Huang, and for me, go into the unknown. If we allow Shu Huang to die, I don't know whose morale will increase. So, at least I know whose morale will increase if you keep certain people alive down there. Well, if you allow people to die down by where Cao Cao is. So anyway, we're going to defeat... Ho Xuan and Yan Chiu. Hopefully we get them separated because they're both together and that's something I don't want to happen. Because they could literally destroy you. Yes, it's you're playing against two well, you're fighting against two non-playable no face characters. However, huge problem. It's two versus one and we're playing on very hard mode. Oh god, did his morale increase? I mean, to 8? Okay, to 7. Alright, we gotta take care of these two quick.
Alright, you run away, then you start to shield, and then you try to do a cheap shot with a Musu attack. That's not happening. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Really? Really? Alright, he's down. Now Yan Xiu. Wherever he is. Where is he? Oh, he's down there. Alright. Yeah, it's funny when three, four, five people attack you at the same time. Enough of the volleyballing. Hopefully that's goodbye. Yeah, I was asking for too much on that one. Alright, now let's go and grab health because I do not want to die to random troops. Don't lag behind. Not just random troops, random and scattered troops. Anyway, he's down, now Lee Khan. There he is. That was a cheap shot. What the fuck? It's not like I'm even the intended target. Alright. Hopefully, we got him. Hopefully. Well, he recovered. Alright, quit showboating. I defeated an officer. Yeah, I hate when they just use that one charge attack non-stop. It's the worst thing in the world. Alright, now let's get these two gate captains. That way it will be easy for Shu Huang to attack Tom Gate. I don't know why I'm doing really shitty. I mean, I even have the speed and I'm still going slow. Alright, one down. Now his morale's at 8. Fuck. So when it comes to him defecting, it might take a little bit longer than normal. Hopefully I'm wrong. Because I know it affects morale and not time. I looked online and... And a friend of mine told me when it comes to Han Sui's defection, it's based on time, and that's complete bullshit. I mean, in a way, it does, depending on the morale. Um, yeah, so, all that's left is Cheng Yi. And part of me wants to go for him. I mean, is he facing Cao Cao head on? Yes, he is. So, let's defeat Cheng Yi quick. And not forget the shield. There we go. Wrong person. Alright, that's another thing that's really pissing me off. I'm gonna keep on hitting the wrong person. Even in the fail recording that I did. Wrong one. I did not mean to do that. Alright, there we go. I 
I'm just gonna have to play cheap. I hate playing cheap, but I have to. Because for some reason, I'm sucking. Maybe it's just not a good recording day. I mean, I know everyone has their off days, but this is just obnoxious. And at the same time, it's been a while since I actually did a recording. Alright, one more hit would do it. I want to finish it off with the actual attack, but I can't. Because I will die. And those attacks by the guard captain is a pain in the ass. Alright, now I'm going to go and make sure Southside doesn't get killed. And not get killed by fucking crossbows. Fucking rat packs. They're the worst. Alright, 100 will be fine. Oh great, now I have Hansui and Machao to deal with. This is not good. So, we might be screwed. But in the process of that happening, I'm gonna go and defeat pretty much everyone in sight, other than Hansui. We can't go further. And Machao. Hopefully, Hansui will defect over time. If he does, great. Hopefully, it's not that long. Like I said, I'm just gonna go and buy time and defeat crossbows, any troops really, until he actually defects. Well, it looks like Hansui's back there, and I'll leave him right there if I have to. Alright. This will help. It will be nice to have a battle axe somewhere, but no mile up. It's going to be hard to find one in this stage. Like I said, just my luck. What was that? I wasn't even the intended target. Didn't look like it to me anyway. I didn't even see where that attack came from. Uh, it was one of Lee Khan's forces. Forget that. Not worth my time. Yeah, don't even think about it. I know sometimes you have to hit Hansui a certain amount of times before he actually get effects. I mean, there's so many different ways in doing it. I don't know what the right way is, though. I mean, it's frustrating. I know this is going to take a long time, and I know, I know I'm bitching about it a lot, but there we go. Thank you. Okay, he defected within 13 minutes. Meanwhile, a friend of mine told me... 10. <laughs> yeah, I think he was a little off on that one. Anyway, now that the item appeared, I'm going to go back there, and then grab the weapon, then come back. Then defeat Machao. How does that sound? <laughs> Is this really the, end? the only problem I can see right now is if I leave <laughs> and Sao Sao gets killed. That's the worst thing that could happen right now. But I grabbed it. Well, I have it now, so. Let's bolt back. Well, it doesn't look like he's getting attacked. But at the same time, when I did a failed... Uh, when I fucked up on... Uh, what was it? Um, whose fifth weapon was it? Or fourth weapon? It was some... Oh, right. It was a survival guide. Apparently, I allowed both catapult attacks to happen. And... Let's just say Zhuka Liang was basically one shot. And that really messed me up. So, I did not want that to happen again in this case but it does look like Salsa has a good amount of health left so if he's here I don't have to worry about him losing all of his health because he'll gradually get it all back because he's a commander and there's so many opportunities for him to get health back 
and he just obliterated the living shit out of Sao Hong. Alright. So far so good. And that's a win. Alright, so... <laughs> other, than <laughs> other than the fact that it took that long for Hansui to defect, the rest of it was easy. The only thing I was really concerned about when I grabbed the weapon was Sal Sal actually dying. But uh, it took us almost 15 minutes to, com to um, complete. Wow, I can't even get a, a sentence in properly. Uh, now I know it's not a good recording day. At least I actually got this fifth weapon done with. All right. So, here's the fifth weapon, the Mystic Fong, or Fang, however you want to say it. I mean, some say Fong, some say Fang. Me, I'll say, you know, I'll say Fang, Mystic Fang. And uh, it does look like a cleaver. I mean, it looks badass. Um, so yeah, it has the death element, which is great. Uh, has additional attack of 24, bow attack of 58, mount attack of 58, and reach of 21. So, yeah, here's the fifth weapon, and uh, yeah, so that's another one down, and we're down to the last two fifth weapons. So, I can skip all this. I'm not caring. So, class of 14, that's not bad. Alright, we'll save. And there you have it. You've been watching my gaming adventures, and I'll see you for the next part where we'll unlock the other fifth weapon that was tied with Xiaohu Yuan with four votes. So, peace.